Can you believe it, everybody? A crocodile. There it is. Sinister beast, everyone's favourite villain of the African wilderness. And it's in the muck that is on, or the scum, if you like, on the top of the Chitwa Chitwa Dam. It's not a very big one. Well, it's big enough to give you a nasty nip and, well, for a human being, it would mean certain death almost. It's probably about, ooh, say six and a half feet long. But to the hippopotamus in this dam, a completely harmless creature. And it'll be looking largely, I think, for catfish. Isn't that cool? <laughs> There's something so sinister and scary about a crocodile. Oh. Now the last crocodile, of course, that we saw was chomping down on a Thompson's gazelle in Kenya all the way back in September. Seems like a lifetime ago, David. Well, this one's not going to be eating any Thompson's gazelles, but it may well be eating the old baby impala and many catfish. And this, everyone, is why you don't ever go swimming in an African water body unless it is on a farm far, far away from any kind of um, protected area. Crocodiles come from all over the place. They find water, no one really knows how, and then they lurk just below the surface waiting for something to eat. that you'd have no idea that he was here. Well spotted David. David found the crocodile everybody. And soon he'll probably disappear. Just sink below the surface. So we're back at the dam. I don't know if Brent brought you here but David has never been here so I thought we'd pop along and see if we couldn't find something interesting, and surely we have. The great Chitwa Chitwa Lake, Lake Chitwa. Almost as big as Lake Michigan. Obviously that's rubbish. And there apparently is a pod of 17 hippopotami here. Uh, we've only seen one or two, I think the rest of them all at the other side of the dam right now. <laughs> 